What is up, my Learn How friends? This is Andy here from the Learn How Group doing our very first game video. This is for iPhone app games, uh, something that I wanted to start doing to kind of play some games, review some games, give my first impressions of games. If this is your first time stopping by the channel, please leave a comment below um, so we can get to know you a little bit better. If you are a returning subscriber on our channel watching this, please also leave a comment. Uh, just say hi, maybe tell me a little bit about yourself so we can get to know you guys a little bit better, what you guys like, what you guys are looking forward to. But yeah, in this video, we're gonna be playing Rolly Vortex. Sometimes I'm gonna be playing games, app games for the very first time, just to kind of give my first impression uh, what it's like to start the game from scratch, kind of see how it how it is and see my thoughts on it. I actually have played Rolly Vortex a couple times already, but we are going to try to get to 50 in today's video. I haven't been able to get there, so hopefully we can get there in this video. So I'm going to open up Rolly Vortex right here on my phone. Please excuse my uh, little ghetto mic setup. I actually have my Rock Band Xbox mic um hooked up to my tripod so this is like a total jimmy rig right here uh so if it's kind of in the way bear with me here we go rolly vortex welcome back dj hawaiian ice that's my game center uh name funny story about that is well i guess it's not really that funny but story behind that is i dj uh for weddings and stuff part-time so DJ Hawaiian Ice, I'm part Hawaiian, my mom is Hawaiian, so that's the Hawaiian, and then Ice comes from Isom. Um, all right, here we go. So Rolly Vortex, really simple game. It's kind of like one of those little simple puzzle games where you just kind of slide back and forth on the screen. You'll see here the little hand that's kind of showing you how to slide back and forth. All you do to start, tap the black ball, put your thumb on the screen, and you slide back and forth to move the ball. Um, there's these little like gem things. I have honestly no idea what those are for. Um, but I'm assuming they're good, so I just try and get them. Oh yeah, and you got the standard glitch that happens when like an ad pops up. We're off to a really good start on my first attempt of the day. Wow, we might actually just break 50 right off the bat. Wouldn't that be amazing? Oh, my thumb is getting super sweaty. Oh, freaking glitch. Are you kidding me? That was a good start though. My thumb is getting sweaty already. Okay, folks, whenever you see these little ad pop-ups, please, for the love of mankind, do not touch the screen. Here we go, little X in the corner, there we go. No, I'm not doing it. I am not dragging to aim. I'm not going to do it, because I know you guys are going to make me download the game if I tap that. Coming soon, gems to black balls. Okay, so I'm assuming with my gems I can get a black ball. Okay, oh, my high's 48. I'm almost to 50, here we go. Okay, so I'm going to press this little uh, rewind, restart button thing. There we go. These games are like those really frustrating, almost like Flappy Bird. Where like, there's no end. Like, it's just like to see how high a score you can get. There's no like levels or anything. It's one of those just like total time wasters. Okay, okay. I've never seen these things move before. Okay, just please don't. Oh my heavens. So yeah, that's the downer of these uh, little free game app things is uh, lots of ads in between. Although I do think they do offer um, a paid version that doesn't have the ads. Here we go. Oh yeah, there you can see up in the top right corner, premium, remove ads. I'm not going to do that though. If you really fall in love with this game, I guess you can remove the ads. It will probably help with the glitching a little bit. I found that the response is pretty good on this, except for in these really tight squeeze spaces. I feel like I've made it through the gap a few times, but it's said that I hit the wall, but I really don't feel like I did hit the wall in these little gaps right here like these. Oh, we got 50. 100 with no glitches. I'm getting some glitches. 
We're going for gold. We're going for gold. We're going for gold. We're going for gold. Ooh, another glitch. Okay, my thumb's getting sweaty. There you go, though. 79 right there. Not a bad start. Thoughts on the game? Oh my gosh, if I have to see another one of these ads. Thoughts on the game? Pretty good time waster. Um, it's not one of those games that you're going to be playing for months. You're probably going to download this game, play it for like two weeks, and then get sick of it. So I don't know if it's like a real long-term game for you. Uh, it might be one that you just kind of stash to just like kill some time if you have a couple minutes. It's not going to be like a Clash of Clans for you where you're going to sit down and play for half an hour. Um, more of a, a bathroom breaker kind of thing. But yeah, that's it. Um, if you do play Rolly Vortex, here's the challenge. Go download the game free in the App Store and come back and leave a comment of your high score. We're gonna see, I'm gonna pin the highest score to the top of the comments and we're gonna see who has the reigning high score on Rolly Vortex. Thanks you guys for stopping by.